Okay, so I made some really cool updates. I'll start off by showing the more basic ones, then I'll go more in depth on the updates that need more explanation. So let's start with the basic ones. We got a new volume slide. We have now four new buttons. The button with the skull will clear the grid. And the rest of the buttons I will explain more later. A new color theme. You can play on the space key. From now on, it will remember your settings. So if you refresh the page or you leave it and re-enter, it will remember your settings. And we get MIDI out now, uh, which means uh, you can control another synth with Hagrid. So it will play whatever Hagrid is playing. Okay, let's have an internal one. A big thanks to Jonathan McKinsey. Uh, he helped me with this. Thank you, Jonathan. The first button is just arrow mode, which means you create arrows when it's selected. You can now create arrows by just clicking and dragging, uh, both for uh, mobile and desktop. So let's get into this is this is one of my favorite new features. Uh, this one is portals. When you select the arrow, you create arrows, and when you select the portal, you create portals. Okay, and okay, let's see what it looks like. If you press one time, you get like a black hole, and you need two holes to make a tunnel, so now you can see that there's a corresponding number. And that means if you enter the tunnel with number one, you're gonna exit the other tunnel with number one. It will continue in the same direction it had before it entered the portal. So in this case, we're gonna just hit the wall. So let's create another portal here and maybe exit out here. So then we're gonna exit this way and then we're gonna, then the cycle's gonna repeat. But that's, let's not finish yet. So if we enter there, we're gonna exit. And yeah, I gotta, yeah, so they come in pairs. So one corresponds with one, and if you create another one, it's gonna be a new number and they are connected. Uh, and if you delete one, let, let's delete number three. Uh, you just double click it and its partner is gonna be erased as well. Let's add these ones together again. Okay, let's see what this sounds like. Uh, or here. Okay, oh, let's try this. And then it starts over. No, okay, then it's gonna go. God damn it, okay. Okay, there it starts over, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm really excited about the next button. It's um, arrow key navigation, which means now you can actually play arpeggios like snake. You can now control the direction with the arrow keys. If you hold down the W key and then make a turn, you will write a new arrow in that direction. If you hold down the E key, uh, you will erase everything in your path. So I'm gonna wrap this video up now because I feel it's getting a little bit too long, but um, I'll make another one and I'll cover more cool stuff like media out and other stuff that I probably forgot to mention. Yeah.